Eiffel. London, 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 London. Eiffel. London, London, London. This is Kogan Cassius for iFilm London. We're at the Royal Albert Hall press conference between Billy Joe Saunders and Tony Hill. With me, I've got promoter Frank Warren. How are you, Frank? I'm fine. You good? Yes, I'm very well. Um, Billy Joe Saunders stepping up to headline this show at the famous Royal Albert Hall. Um, great chance for him to, to claim this Commonwealth title against Tony Hill, isn't it? It certainly is. And to do it in this venue as well, probably the most prestigious venue in the world, bar none. Uh, and... You look at it over the years, the, you know, the, the fighters that have fought here, what they've gone on to do, either defend world titles or win world titles. You know, some of the, probably all the best of British boxing that have fought here over the years. Um, after Nathan Cleverley had to pull out the fight, were you tempted at all to pull the show completely or was this show always going to go ahead? No, because uh, I was determined that we'd go ahead. It was very disappointing that Nathan pulled out, but we determined that we'd move on and carry on with the show because we want to establish boxing back here at, at the Royal Albert Hall and with a view to, uh, obviously, doing more shows here in the future. Um, what is the situation with Nathan Cleverley, um, injury-wise? He had a virus. Um, he picked up a viral infection, and, uh, and now he's uh, recovering, and hopefully he'll be ready to box, uh, hopefully, in July. Is this July going to be the potential big fight that we're, we're waiting for, or is he going to face someone else before he goes into this, like I said, this big fight that we're expecting from him? Well, I'm not sure yet who he's going to be fighting, but we are announcing a big fight next week. Um, Sam Webb and Matthew Hall also on the undercard, which is a great uh, eliminator for that British title as well, isn't it? Yeah, I think for, you know, from a trade point of view, boxing trade point of view, I think it's one of those you know, fights that you know you're going to get a real, as we say, bang up out of the two of them. It's going to be a good fight because I think both of them are hot to trot. And, uh, you know, it's going to be great for the fans. And uh, it's one certainly I'm looking forward to on Saturday. Um, this show's at the Royal Albert Hall. How many shows a year would you look to put at the Royal Albert Hall, Frank? Well, I, I think back in, in the sort of uh, 70 days and 90s, you used to get six to eight shows a year here. I'd like to be doing a similar sort of thing. But, you know, the date's got to become available. We've got some, um, some provisional bookings in, and hopefully uh, we can get that sorted out over the next 12 months or so. Um, can you give us an update on the situation regarding George Groves and um, his injury, and obviously he had to pull out of his fight with Stieglitz? Yeah, George unfortunately pulled out of the fight due to a nose injury. Um, hopefully, again, he'll be back in action sometime in, uh, in, 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 the, uh, in the summer. Is there anything you can tell us about Derek Chisora and um, his appeal? No, it's due to be heard on, I think it's the 14th of May. So uh, that's when everybody hear the evidence and decide what's what. All right, well, Frank Warren, thank you very much for talking to iFilm London. And uh, we'll see you Friday night. Now, Saturday night. Sorry, Saturday night. I'll be there Friday. Well, you can get there early because there'll be a big queue. See you Saturday. Thank you very much, Frank. I feel London, London, London. I feel London, London, London. I feel.